hi everyone and welcome to my youtube channel today i'll discuss with you uh, the process called hom uh, hemostasis so hemostasis basically is defined as the stoppage of bleeding after a cartilage injury takes place there are three stages of hemostasis these are vasoconstriction platelet plaque formation and coagulation of blood or blood coagulation so first one is vasoconstriction so after an injury vasoconstriction mainly the constriction of arterioles and small arteries occurs which is a local phenomenon and leads to decrease in bleeding from the damaged blood vessels when there is an injury the endothelium got damaged and collagen is exposed now platelets which are attached to the collagen got activated and secrete vasoconstrictor substances such as serotonin 5-HT and others which are responsible for the vasoconstriction so bone will run factor is play a major role or involved in the acceleration of the adherence of platelets to the collagen it basically act as a connecting bridge so one will be factor act basically as a connecting bridge between the glycoprotein present on the surface of platelets and the collagen next one is platelet plaque formation so after the adherence of platelet to collagen there is secretion of adenosine diphosphate adp and uh, thrombexinator tx2 these two attracts more number of platelets and activate them ultimately these are also is um, platelet aggregation occurs which lead to the formation of a loose plaque called the platelet plaque or hemostatic plaque this plaque loosely closes the vessel which is ruptured and cause the stoppage of the loss of blood platelet activating factor pap serves a major role in the aggregation of platelets it also accelerate the aggregation of platelets now the third one is coagulation of blood so fibrinogen is converted into fibrin in the process fibrin thread like uh, which is a thread like substance got attached to the platelet plaque which is a loose plaque and uh, which tightly close the ruptured blood vessel uh, the platelet plaque is a loose plaque but when fibrin attached to it it uh, tightly close, close the ruptured blood vessel like a seal so ultimately a blood clot is formed so this is the flow chart of uh, homeostasis this is the flow chart of homeostasis so after uh, there is uh, vascular injury after there is vascular injury there first there upper vasoconstriction then the platelet agree platelet um, and attached to the collagen which leads to and platelet activation occurs then uh, in uh, presence of von willebrand factor there is uh, formation of platelet plaque and in the coagulation cascade there is uh, fibrin conversion of fibrinogen fibrin uh, from fibrinogen and in presence of thrombin and ultimately blood clot form so this much part is known as uh, primary hemostasis because because uh, the stoppage of blood is not uh, occurred properly because uh, the platelet plaque is a loose plaque and this is called secondary hemostasis and after that the the blood got stopped completely the sorry the bleeding got stopped completely because of the formation of blood clot so bwf is here von willebrand factor so this is the flow chart of hemostasis now this is the pictorial depiction of uh, hemostasis first of all uh, there is the injury after that vasoconstriction takes place here vasoconstriction takes place then uh, there is formation of uh, platelet plaque this is collagen platelet plaque formation this is the this is also the uh, this is at the platelets which forms the platelet plaque which forms the platelet plaque these are the platelets 
then uh, ultimately there is plot formation this plot black plot formation so this is uh, all about hemostasis definition um, the three stages vasoconstriction platelet plaque formation blood coagulation the coagulation of blood chart and uh, this is the pictorial depiction so here i am ending my today's video see you in my next video and guys if you like my videos please and please subscribe my channel thanks for watching